I have two projects in the festival in the web series section. I have Fab Life Teresa XO, which is a British beauty vlogger character that I created. She's really fucking hysterical. Excuse my language if you need to bleep that out, my bad. She's kind of like Miranda Sings, but with beauty vlogging. And then I have Reckless Juliet, which is like kind of a dark dramedy about uh, 14 girls and what it's like growing up. And uh, it's also in the web series section. So I got two for, I think there's like 12 people in my category. So my odds are higher than just one. <laughs> wow. So you act in one of them. I act, I produce, I direct it, I wrote everything with Reckless, no, excuse me, with Fab Life Teresa XO. Reckless Juliet's I just produced. So how is it like doing all that stuff? Like, do you have any help? Uh, I have I have some help. I don't have a personal life, but I have some help. <laughs> I work all the time, and it's been great. I mean, Reckless Juliet's was my sister Skylar Barrett's passion project, and I just really wanted her to see it to fruition, and I'm just really happy to be involved in that. And then Fab Life Teresa, I shot uh, Chris Frangiola from Chelsea Lately is in it, and a bunch of YouTubers, and that was just something fun I wanted to do in 2015, and I repackaged it, and I've never submitted to a festival before. This is my first route, so I'm like, hey guys, what's up? I'm really happy to be here. What was the character based off of? The character was based off of, because I've been in the industry for 10 years. I was a stand-up, you know, comedy is like my background. Those are my roots. So I was like, how can I create a character and have it be, you know, something I can do with YouTube? And everyone's like, oh, you're pretty. You do your makeup and your hair. Why don't you do, like, you know, a YouTube video about beauty and makeup? And I was like, that's just not what I went to drama school for and paid, like, so much money to, like, you know, really get in tune with my instrument. I, I don't want to do that. So I was like, let's just make a funny beauty vlogger character and parody it. And that's what I did. So we'll see. And I can't wait to see the tagline on the show is, like, if you can't make it on the big screen, try a much, much smaller screen because it's YouTube. So it's going to be funny to see it on, like, a big screen, <laughs> actual big screen, you know? Can people watch it at all or in the future if they're not here? Yeah, you can watch it on YouTube. If you go to uh, YouTube Sid SYD Wilder, you can see the series and check it out. I actually might take it down soon to... Amazon might be getting it. Uh, so uh, you can see it there for now. And subscribe to my channel, Sid Wilder. What about social media? Where can people find you? You can find me on Instagram. It's my biggest platform, at Sid Wilder, on Twitter. And Facebook is the real Sid Wilder. I don't really care about Snapchat. I like the stories on Instagram. <laughs> is there anything else you'd like to say? I love you. Vote for me if you can. <laughs> and you're beautiful. You are too. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. The next day. So our next winner is uh, for Best Vape Comedy, and that's sponsored by uh, Got Vape. And uh, it wins $250 cash and $250 credit for Got Vape merchandise. And the winner is Fab Life, directed by Teresa Exo, directed by Rob, Jonas, and Sid Wilder. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys, look at this. This is so cute. Okay, hi. Thank you so much. <laughs> Gorgeous. I did. I was like, you know what? You're going to be professional. You're not going to be sad. You're happy for the winner. And I was happy for the winner. But I was kind of like... <laughs> and then they said Sid Wilder for the vaping thing. And I was like, what? Oh my gosh, no way. I was like freaking out. It was so cool. And I've never like won anything. So this is like pretty cool. And then I got this big check. I was like, hey. <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm like, thank you guys so much for having me. Thank you. I, I'm so honored and humbled to be part of this festival and to win it is just really fucking amazing because I've been in this business for 10 years and this is just really a, like, I'm just so blown away. Thank you so much. <laughs> uh, I'd like to thank my mom for always believing in me. <laughs> I feel like I'm out like, I'm like at the Oscars or something. Um, I honestly, my mom, she's here with me tonight. She's been my biggest supporter and the reason why I'm even able to do anything that I'm doing is because she believed in me. So I want to give, and God, it's Easter Sunday. I mean, come on, like that's huge. Like I should have thanked him first, but 
definitely God and um, and my friends and my family who never quit believing in me and like always encouraged me to keep writing and that I could do it because you definitely get a lot of haters in this business and being like you know a model not that it's that hard you know it's like oh gosh poor model you know don't feel bad for me but you definitely get a lot of crap for it in this town because people look at you one way and they don't think that you're capable of doing certain things so I'm very grateful that this wonderful festival gave me this opportunity and this voice and money <laughs> And an award, so thank you guys so much. I love you, and I can't wait to put this all over social media. <laughs> After this, I want to have maybe one drink, and then I'm going to go home and write, because I'm writing a pilot right now, and I'm really excited to produce it this summer. June 1st is my deadline to finish everything, so that's what I'm going to do tonight. Very nerdy, but that's me. <laughs> thank you guys, I'm so excited. And I'm going to submit to Holly Shorts, so watch out for me there. It's, it's this summer, right? August. Kind of summer, right? It's summer. Technically, it's summer in August. Yeah. Thank you. And I'm going to like your photos and comment on your Instagram. Hello.